This video is how to thread a big plastic needle for weaving. Okay, you need to pick your first color of yarn that you're going to start weaving with. Okay, and find the end. Okay, make sure when you're taking yarn off of these little yarn rolls that you aren't pulling on it, but you're carefully, gently unwrapping the yarn from the yarn ball. If you pull on it even a little bit while you're taking it off the yarn, it's going to tangle the yarn and it's not going to be usable. You're going to cut a pretty long piece for weaving. Usually the length of your entire arm, okay that's pretty long, the length of your entire arm is pretty good from shoulder to wrist. Okay, I'm going to pinch the very end of the yarn with one finger and I'm going to push it through that hole. And I'm just going to pull it through a little bit. We do not want it double when we weave. Okay, so you can see there's a really long end and then there's a short end. That short end is called slack. Having it about the length of your hand is good when you weave. Make sure when you hold your needle when you're weaving that you pinch that very end of the needle. Okay, so then when you're weaving and you have to tug on the yarn, it's not going to come off the needle. If I hold the needle up here, you can see it's going to come right off. Okay, so pinch your fingers over the hole in the needle as you weave and then that won't be a problem. Okay, the next thing you would have to do is we would knot this end of the yarn to our warp strings in our weaving, but I'll show that in another video.